So I'm sure by now a lot of you guys know this, but I've got like two kind of running goals in this game. One is to get a diamond of every species, and the other is to get a diamond with every weapon. So we've been working on the species one for, I don't know, a year and a half maybe? And the diamond with every weapon we've kind of like had done, and then new guns get added, and we have more goals to work towards. So we got the 45 air gun uh, diamond whitetail on Friday's stream. So I thought we'd bring out the 30 odd sticks, and we've been all over the maps that have the true moose. I just wanted to have a different scenery to hunt on, so I think for is going to be good for this. There's a lot of species that uh, we can get integrity on, potential uh, diamonds for the 30 odd six, and yeah, Verhunga does tend to be pretty good at actually producing diamonds. I don't know if I would actually count a Gemsbuck diamond, at least like a level four female Gemsbuck diamond. I guess they're as legit as any, I don't know. Just seems like they're a little easier to get. Anyway, can sex fine? I thought that might have been a blonde, but he was just laying in the sun, so that's another thing we can work on while we're doing this. Speaking of Gemsbuck, that's kind of cool anyway. A good size blonde for, hey, I didn't even realize I was spotting that. I mean, there's not a very good chance that's actually going to make diamond, but we're definitely going to go shoot it. So here's the thing. Spinal cord is really, really easy on Gemsbuck. Do I go for that, or do I just go for, like, a safe brain shot? Because I think when they're drinking, their drinking animation's pretty doable to brain shot them. Feeding, they move their head around a lot, but you can see he's fairly still. We'll kind of take our time getting into 150, because they drink for 45 minutes in-game still. They stop drinking at 8, and yeah, the wind's kind of bad, so we'll just kind of sneak in here. Might be getting done with this a little sooner than I figured. So the one problem I see here is I'm not going to be able to get like a perfect straight on brain shot, which means if I shoot too high, I don't get the kind of maybe mercy of catching a neck bone because this guy is going to be my way. But like I said, they're they're pretty still. I think we can hit that. So I'll, I'll let him stand back up. We'll make sure he's going to be having his head down for a moment. And I guess we're just going to go for this. Like I said, there's a fair chance he doesn't even make it anyway. Nice. Spinal cord? No. That time? No. Pretty sure he's gonna die. That'll help. Just make sure we're not gonna lose consec for some reason. We just started, but you never know. I feel like I shot higher than I normally would on where I get like the accidental spinal cord shots, because the hitbox for that's a little bit off, which is why I said it's easy. But. I might be glad we went for a brain shot. Maybe uh, spinal cord with the 30 odd six is more difficult. I think the penetration is similar, and I know I've done it with a 7 mil, so maybe it's just a matter of being a little more perfectly broadside, but that guy is over here. I'm going the wrong way. Right there. And I don't think I'm going to bother screenshotting, although, how did he land? Yeah, he's got one horn. Kind of buried. You know what? Just one. And although we can't see things, good enough. So, are we done already? Nah, he's close though. 941. And even I said I wouldn't have the mercy of being able to catch a neck shot if I messed up. Somehow I actually did. So, brain and neck. Go figure. Not the diamond with the 30 odd six I was kind of hoping for when I saw that, but that's a heck of a start to this. That's another pretty decent one. I mean, he's up to the, the max estimate. So, for science, can I spinal cord this guy by accident? I can, but I used the wrong gun. <laughs> they, they look way too similar. What I probably should do is just buy one of the, um, the other variants just carry one wooden stock and one of the like carbon stocks or whatever the the other one is so correct gun this time might have been too low I want to see what the quick kill is anyhow but should have been higher for the accidental spinal cord I think so that's the big four 887's not bad BC I'm under the spinal cord and still got it 
but I think I was kind of way under the spinal cord with the 30 odd six shot. One more try at this. Got that one. So it is doable. Just need to actually place the shot correctly. Anyway, I think that's probably about enough gems buck hunting. 79% ain't half bad for a, a class three. But yeah, I'm going to go and switch the time to lions. They're pretty easy to brain shot while they're drinking. And also the way they sort of stop when they're fleeing, even a messed up shot, you can still pull off a quick hard shot and maybe save quick kill. So yeah, just got to be a little higher on that. So let's go switch the time. I wish I could spot that because I don't want to just take a shot where I think it's hard is. Because if that is a legendary, I really don't need to be messing it up, but I'm fairly certain he's stuck in fleeing state. I do think I can get it. Uh, just throw another shot in there for follow-ups if it is going to help. I really couldn't even tell if he did tip over or not. I mean, I kind of doubt it's anything good, but you never know. It's kind of the thing with all lions, regardless of what level they are, they will sort of get stuck fleeing, or at least stand around. I don't think they're supposed to do that. Was a decent one. 858 gold, and we did make the hard shot, and I guess he must have been dead before the second shot got there. Because nothing registered. I really kind of feel like something changed with this spot, because this is the, the northeast lake up here. And when I used to come here, there'd be like three, four, five lions sometimes, but anytime recently, it's just been maybe two at the most, and a lot of times it's just one, so I don't know if they've kind of made lions sort of spread out on the map a little more, or what? But regardless, he kind of has to die, so can you turn back this way? Almost. There you go. Nope, too far. Should I go broadside? Uh, whoa, he really jumped when I hit him there. Oh, that's going to be annoying. Can't even get a follow-up in? I don't even know if I hit him, but he's not that big. So we did get the second shot. The first one's just way far left, which makes sense. He actually wasn't big enough to make gold. So at least we didn't mess that up. Ooh. Man, another one. He's got the, the big horns again, so there'd be a chance. Actually doesn't seem like any lion showed up here at all. That's kind of weird. This spot's usually been pretty good too, but at least the positive is then there shouldn't be any problems going to get this guy. Like, there's not going to be any lion spooking him, I wouldn't think. I might even go for that spinal cord shot just because we're kind of practiced up on it. He kind of turned, so I thought I'd try to call him over. I just don't know what shot's actually really good to go for. Because they have a lot of like minor head movements. Just when they're kind of just standing there. So I don't, if I can help it, I don't want to go for brain. I can get a second shot in. I can keep integrity with two shots. So a follow-up would be doable. Like I could go for the spinal cord and if I miss it, get another lung hit. He does look big. I mean, I've thought that a lot about male level 5 Kim's book, but he, he definitely looks it. He's also... In absolutely no hurry. I guess we'll just... Jeez. I guess we'll kind of just wait for an angle. Hi. Oh, aggressive? Uh-oh. I didn't even know they did that. I'm going to go hide in here then. Don't kill me. <gasps> Ow! It's not fair. I'm trying to shoot something else. Leave me alone. Okay, so now that we've been forced inside, this guy didn't notice anything. Shut up. Can I get heart? Maybe I should just go for brain. If he looks back at me, I'll just go for it. Again, it's so unlikely he's actually diamond. Dude! How did you do that? You're going to kill me, aren't you? All right. I think he left. Nope, he didn't leave. Look at me. <laughs> I need to shoot you. 
Now, get out of here. Mickey, I can check. I don't know if it actually left. I don't want it. I don't want it to get me. Ah! Well then. I hope he's still here when I get back. <laughs> That's so dumb. I don't really know which one it was anymore, but um That's the one that's gonna get punished for it anyway. So we're still good. I don't think this is actually the one. I thought it had different tusks, but whatever. Even though we got sent back to the lodge, we did not lose Consex, so I've been rushed on a lot of diamonds. Like, I've, I've rushed a lot of shots. I'm not certain I've ever actually killed a diamond being rushed by something that was trying to kill me. I mean, it'd be kind of lame. First one to do that would be a Warthog, but that would be a first. So, level 5 male Gemsbuck, round 2. Even smaller, 934. Decent shot, though. I mean, like I said, I, I was rushed into it. That was a, definitely a weird one. So I think we got time to go check one more uh, lake for lions. I don't really know where I want to go, though. Whoa. No wonder there's no lions up north. They're all down here. I'm pretty sure I just got that effect of, like, fast traveling and close animals not being visible. Because I came over here. I looked down here. There was nothing. Then I ran like 50 meters down that way and could hear all these guys because they, they have that really loud breathing sound again like they had on the uh, Trailblazer bear. So just a, a little tip. If, if you're fast traveling to a tent, I don't think it affects lodges. But if you're fast traveling to a tent, go like 100 meters or so in one direction and then turn back towards the tent because there might have been animals close by that just like weren't there. What are you doing? That's kind of silly. Not going to get anywhere doing that. Almost a gold. Really haven't had the luck with lions. But, I think I have a, a last ditch effort idea. One more attempt at trying to get a, a diamond with the 30 odd 6 this hunt. So this zone, right here. This wildebeest rest zone. It's a really good spot. Almost a guarantee there's going to be a herd of wildebeest there between, what was it, 9, 9.30 and 12.30? And I've had a lot of good ones here, so we'll give it a shot, go rest to that time, and maybe there'll be a diamond waiting. So, somehow, I managed to sneak, like, past this herd, and then I spooked them back behind me. Like, how I missed 30-plus wildebeest resting in one place, I have no idea. But I'm pretty sure I kind of saw everything I was running through and looking for tracks quickly, but I didn't see any really big horns, so I am going to go check a different rest zone because I'd rather actually find something than wait for a herd that I don't think has anything big in it. So, this isn't what I came down here for. I thought there was a Wildebeest rest zone somewhere, like, down on this hill. But I do think that might be a diamond. I'm pretty sure it's big enough, because there's another four. I don't know where she went. Oh, there. And you can clearly see this one's bigger. So, maybe. Maybe. And I talked about with the uh, the five, like, a follow-up if I miss the spinal cord. Which we're going to need. I think we're good now. I hope. That would kind of suck if I messed that up, but, uh, it is a Gems Buck, so I wouldn't complain too much. A ton of them up there, too, but I don't see anything crazy. I wouldn't mind a can check, because I did do like the whole change in the time and fast traveling so we'll go drop one of them she's actually down right there too so I think we dodged a bullet there by ironically enough using another bullet and that'll bring that guy down okay so we're still good hopefully I didn't screw that up that would be pretty unfortunate but I feel like it went down quick enough I mean, she ran like 45 meters. I have the center of the, the hunting pressure marked, so I think we're okay. About to find out if we are. Hey, we actually lost quick kill? Wow, that is, that is dumb luck there. <laughs> 9.51. So I double lunged it. I was just a, a little low, and I knew I was too far forward on this. I don't know if that uh, that second shot was enough to keep the quick kill high enough. 
Well, whether it's 100% quick kill or 92%, if it's a diamond, it's a diamond. So, uh, I think that's got the 30 odd six off the list. Interesting pose there. I guess I'll tax that. Maybe throw it in a, a different lodge, but yeah, after three uh, potential diamond level gems buck, we finally get one, and then the only one that I don't get full quick kills, so go figure. But anyway, I don't think we're going to go back to the lodge. Like I said, that's not going like in the main one, so I think we'll just wrap it up here. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.